My name is Judy Langdon, and I'm the Ed Asner Family Center Music Therapist, as well as the Camp Director. And I'm really happy to see you here today. I hope you enjoyed all the music that we've been listening to throughout these past couple of weeks. Finding songs that you really like, finding songs that you've never listened to, learning some music, learning about the guitar and the keyboard. And I know that with all of this uncertainty, it's hard to think about what's next, what's coming up next. But I also think it's important to think about all the people in your life as well. We talked about mothers. We talked about family. We talked about friends. But it's still kind of hard to know how we can you know, still have that friendship, still build those friendships that are friends and our loved ones. So before we start with all the music, let's warm up. So who first? as you can with a big ah and do do me so me do Sometimes again. Good. I think we're all warmed up. So the songs I'm going to share with you today are about friendship and those people that maybe are not in your home all the time, but the people that are outside your home that you're not able to see as frequently as you were before. And that might be really hard right now, right? Not be able to hug somebody. You remember how we talked about physical love. We're not able to do the things we've been we've been so used to doing um, prior to all this. So I'm sure you've heard this song. Maybe you haven't. It's called One Call Away. And it was in the movie Sing. And it's pretty much about that everyone's just one call away. And then if you need something, you can always reach out and ask for help. So listen to the lyrics, sing along with me, and think about all those people that you can call if you ever need something. You 
song with me. I know you're thinking of different people in your life, people that are outside your home, people you can't see all the time, and um, people that maybe you have called that you have reached out in FaceTime or through um, Facebook or different social media ways of reaching out to people that you can't be with in the here and now. And this is a good song to remember that, that we're only just all just one call away. That hasn't changed. No matter all the things that have changed around us, things that are not the same from school, to being outside, to seeing relatives, to how, to how we show love and affection to one another, those things have all changed. But things that have not, and have not changed through this process is that we're all just one call away. That if you need anything, if you need any help, I know the Ed Asner Family Center has so many different things that if you or your family or your siblings need support. There's there's drumming, there's yoga, there's so many different things you can use and participate in. And same with friends. There's all these resources. You just have to reach out and ask for help. And sometimes that is the hardest thing to do, is to just ask for help. So I hope that you think this song and remember that no matter how you're feeling in a day, no matter how you think that you you can't express those feelings to others, that you're just one call away, that everything is reachable, that no matter how you're feeling, we don't, we don't know, we can't always feel the same as others, but we can always empathize and we can always help and support. So no matter how badly you feel, you can always reach out and ask for a friend for a little help. And you can be that person, right? So reach out to other people, because like I said, it's not easy to ask for help. So be that person for someone else. All right, so some, let's, let's sing another song that maybe is a little more upbeat, a little more fun. So I don't know if you've heard this song, but I know that your parents have heard this song. It's no, uh, there ain't no mountain high enough. There ain't no valley low enough. There ain't no river wide enough that keeps me away from you. And yes, this, this virus and this thing that makes us feel uncomfortable and maybe makes us feel sad at times makes us feel like there's a huge mountain in front of us, a huge river that's separating us, uh, a valley that is so vast that we cannot see that other person. But with all of that said, it really isn't. We're only one call away. Nothing can keep us apart from each other. So let's sing this song. If you're feeling a little jazzy, you can pick up an instrument. You can pick up something that you like to shake, something you've made, something that's new, something that's exciting, or just dance, whatever you feel like. This is time to let out some energy and just have some fun, okay? You ready? So just listen. 
listen, baby. Ain't no mountain high, ain't no valley low, ain't no river wide enough, baby. If you need me, call me, no matter where you are, no matter how far, just listen, just listen, I'll be song please look it up there ain't no mountain there ain't no mountain big enough there ain't no valley large enough there ain't no river wide enough it doesn't matter how far you are from that person if you care about them reach out to them give them a helping hand remind them that you're always there for them and to remind yourself that we're always here for you as well right all right we have a couple more songs one more song actually we're going to do it all on the piano today. Different, changing things up, right? So about this piano, there's a lot of things that look and sound like a piano because it's the Western region music. This is our tonality. So if you go anywhere around the country, music sounds differently because that's how they perceive a sound and a tone. And they've decided that that's what we would call whatever major or minor or their style of music is. So some people think, some people think this sounds a little bit, a little Egyptian. Might sound a little bit different from a different country. But that's the interesting thing about music. Music can make us feel and understand things from a scene in a movie, from the rain, from being sad. If you played a happy song during those moments, you would think that person was happy to be in the rain. Just the perception of music. So playing happier songs or playing sad songs can help us feel that emotion that you might be craving, right? So you might turn on a sad song when you feel sad to feel that empathy that others give us, right? When they say like, oh, I, I, I understand you. I, I can understand that feeling. Songs can do the same thing without, without being a person in front of you. They can make you feel like they understand you, that we understand each other. 
And as well as playing a sad song, it's as important to play happy music, to fill your life with happiness, to remind you of those good times. Because music can do that as well. It can remind you of the past. It can make you think about the future. So working on music and figuring out what different sounds mean di different to us, sometimes we just use the pentatonic scale. So this is called an easy cushion, mostly because it's super easy to play. You can't do anything wrong on this because we're using the pentatonic scale. And that means that we've gotten rid of some of the solfege. So notice this one's our do, C, do, and then we have re, re, the letter D, we have me, the letter E, and then we skip F, we don't have F. And then we have G, so, then we have A, la, and then do, we skip T, the B. And that way there's no dissonance. Dissonance is the sound that we hear that makes us feel uncomfortable. So it can sound like this, or it can sound like this. Ah, dissonance, it makes us feel uncomfortable. But this makes us feel okay. that dissonance in there. That still sounds fine, but listen to this. Do you think a baby would want to sleep to that? But dissonance is as important as other things. So if you have any instruments, even a xylophone or a glockenspiel, or even an instrument like mine, the easy cushion. Go ahead and play it, and try and just play the C, D, E, G, A, and C, and just improvise on it. You won't make anything wrong. Nothing will go wrong. And it's an easy way to make beautiful music. So go ahead and pick up an instrument like that if you have one. If you don't, just sing along. You can sing. Mm, do, do, do. Play along and sing along a little. Okay? So I will by the Beatles.
So no matter how you played, if you got to improvise a little bit on those in on those notes, the C D E F G A C. If you improvise a little bit on those, or you just sang along, whatever you were able to sing or play or make a sound or make a rhythm, giving that music and singing music that makes you feel good, that make you remember all the people that love you no matter what you do, no matter the distance, no matter how far away, they will always love you because they're only one call away. They're only one little phone call, text, FaceTime, Zoom. There's so many opportunities we have in this day and age that you can reach out to somebody if you're not feeling well, if you're not feeling good, if you're worried about the future, and that's why there's so many opportunities here from art, how to express yourself, or music. So don't stop expressing. Don't worry about what people think about you. Just do what you feel is right. And remember all the people around you that really love you for who you are, no matter what. That they will always love you for now and forever. So give them a call. Send them a message. Reach out. Tell them that no matter how far they are, no matter how mountains or rivers, that you are there for them, as well as they are there for you. Thank you so much for making some music with me, especially on the piano. Today, listening and singing along, and remember to comment any songs that you really liked or songs that you wanna hear or listen to, and know that I can't wait to hear your voice and to see you in person. But for right now, this is really a great opportunity for all of us to make some music together and remember how many people in our lives we love. So I'll see you next time. This is Judy from the Ed Asner Family Center. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and share your thoughts and ideas with us. And I will see you real soon. Bye.